So there is an application that can help you to cheat in uh, lead code style coding assessment. So this guy just posted that there is a danger app that helps you to cheat on lead code style software engineering interviews without being detected. He just also left the link here and he just mentioned that don't use it. Please don't engage in cheating. It is morally reprehensible. So uh, I just want to click on this link and I was very curious to use it, but I have seen uh, this software is not free. You have to pay $60 in order to use for Mac and Windows. So uh, there is one guy who just documented all of the things like he just used the software and he got cracked Amazon interview and he got the offer letter as well. Here you can see that. So he will flash the uh, offer letter here. He just cracked the Amazon University SD intern uh, invitation. Okay. Actually, pricing is not a big problem you can get a cheaper version as well if you want to search alternative for this application so the main problem is let me describe the main problem but before that i'm also working in a, uh, as a senior analyst in amazon so so the main question is whether you should use this type of cheating in your coding assessment or not so let's describe this with this scenario let's suppose you got a coding test from an mnc like amazon microsoft and you have cleared that test using that type of tool and got off letter as well so once you got off letter you got onboarded to the company and now the real problems come in your life so you have to understand that these companies are not solving the code problems in their offices they are doing real world problem solving so when you got onboarded you will also get a real world problem but what you did you did the cheating in your coding assessment you did cheating to do the lead code type of uh, coding assessment and some companies are doing uh, solving real world problems like working on their ai and mls and some companies are solving uh, quantum computer problems like Microsoft and still you can use this type of cheating if you want to uh, if you are expecting a manual testing kind of job role in a company you can still use it because you don't need to code after getting job and if you are expecting quality analyst job like me I'm working as a senior analyst so you can use it